We are back with a C-class fight. Mohamed El Kadiri from Team Aussie is facing Tim Van Housen from the E10 training gym. They both meet at 65 kilograms. Very hyped. Good inside leg kick to start from Mohamed. Good. Catch the kick and swept him. Good. Oh. Oh, good. We see the difference in technique right away. Both very skilled fighters. Good TP, very well timed from Mohamed El Kadiri. As I'm trapped in the corner here, Mohamed El Kadiri is going at it. Wow. Very, very good. Tech here. Spurn punch attempt missed. Has him, has him against the rope again. Van Housen needs to take care of that. When he's trapped, that he goes out a little bit more so that El Kadiri is not throwing those bombs. Good counter here from Van Housen. Good, knee, good left hook here. Mohamed Al Kadiri's timing is very good. Oh, plays with the angles. I love to see that. I love to see that. Stepped out, got him with the cross. But uh, Mohamed Al Kadiri's timing is very good. Uh, when uh, Van Housen is catching, uh, is kicking him, he's either countering with two or three hands, or catching the kicks and trying to sweep him. He's kind of nullifying the. Um, some of the attacks of Van Housen, which looks good on the judges' scorecards and boosts the confidence of a fighter. Or on the other hand, could take it away. But it doesn't mean that Tim Van Housen did not have his moments. Good first round, but in my opinion, uh, right now, which is just the start, Mohamed Al Khadiri has got his nose in front. We see Tim Van Housen in the E10 training. I once commentated a fight from him. Oh, coach woke him up. Nearly got me to wake up again. I would guess he's trying to uh, fire up his fighter and bring him to focus more because he knows that he could do more than what he just showed us. And I know it as well because he uh, once commentated his fight. Very, very skilled fighter, really. Let's see if the uh, water bomb helps something. It seems like it. Mohamed Al Kadir is still there. Oh, good cross here from Tim Van Housen. Opa. Oh, a Not a well placed shot. Good catch here. Again, good reflexes from Mohamed Al Kadiri. Opa. Two high kicks in a row from Mohamed Al Kadiri. Really taking all targets available. And countering every shot, nearly every shot, or giving one in return, so to say. Oh, good cross here from Tim Van Housen. Mm, missed the kick. Went into a spinning back kick. Good. The one thing that Tim could do is that um, he knows that Mohamed Al Kadir is trying to catch a lot of kicks and trying to uh, counter a lot of kicks. So he could set him up. Show him the leg kick, give him a cross like that. Catch him again, threw him on the ground. It looks dominant on the scorecards and does more mental damage 
than physical damage, which is at least as important as the physical damage. Good knee feint step in here from Mohamed Al-Qadiri. Very good second round. Very good second round. Mohamed Al-Qadiri is really giving a good performance here. Really good performance. But Van Hosen is still there. Cannot be counted out. But probably Mohamed Al-Qadiri's confidence is through the roof right now. After a lot of successful sweeps, a lot of successful counters. But in the second round, Tim Van Housen, uh got a little bit more active and landed some clean, good shots. But I don't know if that was enough to get him the, the whole round. We shall see. The last round is coming on the way. Good one, two here. He rocked him. Got him through the ropes. Oh! He's placing bombs. Mohamed Al Qadiri is not going backwards. That's not on his mind. He wants to get that W. Oh, good uppercut here from Tim. Oh, good left hook here from Van Hosen. Still a lot of time to work. Still 120. Oh, oh! Again, very good defense. Al Qadiri rolled the hook and countered with the hook, uh, with with the combination. Got him at the ropes again. He's charging him. Relentless pressure. I think that Tim might need a finish here to get the win. Ooh. Got him at the ropes again. Good. He's going out. 30 seconds to work. Good hands here. Will faint and a one two from El Kadiri. Fifteen more seconds. Can he pull it off? Oh, big cross here. Oh! Mohamed El Kadiri playing here. Oh, what a fight. What a fight. What a performance. Respect to both athletes, but in my opinion, my personal opinion, Mohamed Al Qadiri is taking this one back home to Team Aussie. We shall see what, how the judges scored this one, but it's still, we never know. But very, very good. Very good fight. I think that Mohamed Al Qadiri surprised a lot of people here. But uh, we shall see. One final to the center of the main rings. When first of all, a big applause for these two fighters. <laughs> applause for both athletes. Mohamed Al Qadiri takes the win back home to Team Aussie. In my opinion, well deserved. Very, very good performance here. But Tim, keep your head up. Still young, still a lot to go.